All right, Robbie, quick pin. Then. Did you even get a sweat going? Did you no, get a, it was I didn't. 29 seconds, I think, huh? Yeah, I didn't get a sweat going. But. Okay, you, you went out, uh, what was that, across knee pick to oh, yeah. was like a lateral? Yeah, knee pick, and he started to ladder, try to lateral drop me, so I circled, and he just kind of fell. Circled away from his yeah. hips? Yeah. Okay, you told me, you were thinking, man, maybe I shouldn't pin him, I want to do some work. Yeah, I don't know, I saw a lot of my uh, Clyde friends here and stuff, some people from back home, and I pinned him, and I was like, man, you know, should I do it now or what? I started thinking about it. I was like, I got him on his back, why not, you know? Okay, you're one of the top three guys on the team. Uh, a lot of people, you know, say you, Jordan Keller, and obviously Marcus, three top guys. What are your expectations this year? You guys are in the EWL, uh, predominantly a, a very tough wrestling league. But, you know, what do you got to do to get to the NCAAs, and what are your expectations? Uh, you know, right now I need, uh, you know, just keep working on the small things. Me and Marcus both, you know, and and out of the room just working together and uh, you know moving forward and we you know in our individuals we've been working hard and uh, you know we both want the goal of you know you know stepping on the podium at EW, uh, nationals right this year and winning the EWLs that's my goal is to win the EWLs and you know be on the podium for NCAA so okay you know. well one end of the decision uh, he's 60, you're 65, he's 74. What went into the decision? You're taller than him. Yeah. What went into that decision for you guys going those weights? Uh, we were both kind of wanting 65, but you know, it just kind of fell, and I, I wasn't really too worried about it. Neither was coach. And you know, it ended up pretty much he, at the time when we were thinking about which weight we were going, he was weighing more than me, so he decided to just go that way. And it came down to that week I was sick, you know, I was losing a lot of weight. So that's why he just kind of just decided 74. You know, he's not cutting much, neither am I. We're both feeling good. And I think that's going to contribute to, what, you know, our success this year. What do you think of the Clyde Flyers this year, man? Uh, right now, we were injured the last two weeks, but, you know, we're coming back. You know, Eric and my brother both had surgery on their knees, and they'll be working to come back. And, uh, a lot of think. Clyde Flyers. How many Clyde Flyers on the roster right now here at Cleveland State? Three right now. We had five, but, you know, things happen. But right now I think all three can get in the lineup, you know, if uh, they uh, decide to find a spot for them. You know. All right, last question. If there's a dual meet this year between the Oak Harbor Rockets and the Clyde Flyers, is going to win? <laughs> Clyde Flyers are going to win. <laughs> We're going to dominate them. You're going to dominate. They're chumps, yeah. right? Yeah. I'll just bump up CJ, or yeah. CJ Magrum. Uh well, you know, you know, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, hey, thanks for the time, yeah. Robbie. I appreciate it. And what are the, what are the teammates call you? Uh, Wabi. Wabi, why is that? I don't know. They just <laughs> always call me Wabi because <laughs> right. of Tyler Young. All right, hey, thanks for the time, Rob. And uh, go Flyers, I guess, yeah. right? Yeah, go All Flyers. Right. Thanks.